Alright everyone, hello and welcome to a parkour map that I'm definitely going to butcher the name of. This is, well, uh, only parkour to that being you, that being you temple, that being you, I don't know. It's, it's cool, it's, it's this thing, it's based off a real actual landmark, a real temple, and here it is. This is the original temple in Bagan, Myanmar, probably saying these wrong, it, yeah, temple that. And there it is. Nice big temple, and this is it in Minecraft. And you got a park all around, all around it. It looks like a pretty big map, it might take a while, but we have a book. Oh, there's also this. Four blocks of checkpoints if you're stuck, equip the helmet, and yeah. Pretty cool. There's a book over here, I'm gonna read this before we start. Welcome to Only Parker 2. Temple, the second in the series. As the name suggests, there's a park map only. You jump through eight levels of difficulty gradually. I guess increasing in difficulty. Uh, the stopwatch measures your time for the next two levels, then the next six. I don't get this, but I guess we'll see what happens when it's when we start. Rules. To start, press the start button. Pretty good rule. Take a tour of the spawn for more information. This map was built in Survival 1.16. Uh, Temple is one one scale recreation. Uh, the codes are not res uh, respected in all the interior of the building. At the end of the map, you can explore the temple in more detail and find a redstone mystery. Ooh. Created by all these guys right here. Now, it looks like you get a rank or something at the end when you complete it. I'm not too sure. We'll see. Yeah, let's just start. Nice overview. Nice monk over there on the right. I hope that's a monk and I didn't just insult someone by giving it the wrong name. It looks like a lot of parkour. Only parkour 2. The temple. First part of the map, level 1 to 2. Now it says those blocks are checkpoints. I don't know what this is. Maybe it's also a checkpoint. Maybe there's five different checkpoints. So, first part time. Yeah, so the first two... I keep saying so, I know. The first two levels are timed in the same timer, but the third to eighth one are a separate timer, I, something like that, I don't know. But anyway, it's been a while since I've done some proper parkour, and I'm kind of glad I'm doing it, because I like parkour. It's good, and I'm pretty okay at it. I don't mind puzzles, but you can get, you know, you can have so many puzzles, and too much is, you know, too much of a good thing. But yeah, puzzle, uh, parkour, I, I can do it all day. Okay, I don't know why there's four different blocks for checkpoints, but sure. The goal is to not fail at all, obviously, because it's parkour and you don't really want to do that. Kind of the objective not to do that. Um, but if I do, hopefully the checkpoints do actually work. I'm not seeing an, 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 any indication that I've actually got a checkpoint. I'm hoping if I stand on the block, it just works. So, is that still... Can I stand on this? I don't really want to, just in case... I can't, okay. That's pretty lucky. Is this the second level now? Now the block has changed colour. This looks like a interesting interior. What is that? A, a Buddha statue in, in the temple. Instead of building it, it just made a painting. That's a, a nice way of doing it. This is... In, look at this, this block palette. Uh, that's a lot of blocks. I, I hope it's not too noisy. I hope the textures aren't too noisy for YouTube's compression. I hope it's fine to look at. I, I, I don't really know how YouTube handles it, but anyway. Are we going to be going back outside? I think... Oh, obviously we are. There's all that stuff at the top, right? A little mosaic looking kind of diamond looking thing. I don't know what it was, but... We're going to be parkouring around that, I'm sure. So far, though, I don't think i failed a single time. And now that I've said that, I've 100% jinxed it. We did just get a checkpoint, though, so if we do fail right now, we won't lose too much progress, so it's not too bad. What is this? Look to the sky. Maybe there are Lucky and Di- Oh, maybe there are Lucy and Diamonds. Lucy in the sky with diamonds, eh? Ooh. Uh, I guess I gotta land on this before the levitation runs out. There we go. That's a lantern. I thought it was a button. Alright. That was the first part. See your high scores for part one. I got 2 to 2. Is that time? Oh no, I got 159. Uh, and the record, at least for the people who made it, is 112. Um, I, I could definitely be better than 159. I was looking around a little bit. Ooh. Uh, it's French. Beaucoup uh, de protesteurs ont pris depuis... I don't know how to speak French. I don't know what that means. 
uh, yeah, I don't know. Is there an English translation? Mass protests have been uh, taking place across Myanmar since the military seized control on 1st of February 2021. Wow. 950 death between one. Okay, that's uh, unfortunate and dark. I didn't expect that. That's about done if you want to retry. I don't want to retry. Well, uh, let's carry on. Second battle map 3 to 8. Those first two levels went faster than I thought. Maybe these next six. That's six levels. Yeah, six levels won't you know take too long, and this will be a pretty normal length video. I don't know. That's the hope. Oh, ice park, although, and if I fall, it's a long way down. The checkpoints do seem pretty well spaced out, though. There's the first fail. That was it. It was jumping onto a ball block. It's a difficult jump. It's hard to judge how high they are. I jumped way too early. Unfortunate, but it's all good. One fail so far is not bad at all. I will try to not fail more though. I do want to see if I can get a, a, a pretty good time, so I'm not going to be looking around too much. Maybe a little bit, but I, I want I want to see if I can get a good high score. And obviously if I get a, a, a decent score, then you guys can play them up for yourself and compare your score to mine, which is something that I always love doing. Now, if you if you go through this map more than once, obviously you're gonna, you know, be a lot faster on the second attempt. I'm not gonna be doing that. I'm gonna have one attempt at this, one clean attempt, and hopefully I get yeah a decent score. It does look like oh I'm surprised I made that. It does look like this is it's gonna get longer and longer the levels though, because they seem to be extending out further and further away from the temple. And it, keep go it keeps going around in like a, a, a circle kind of shape. So, I feel like it's going to be harder and harder and get longer and longer. That sounds weird, I know. Don't think about it too much. Big jump! That was the first big one. That I don't think about it too much. I don't know why I'm making so many innuendos. It's not on purpose. Anyway, I forgot what I was talking about. Oh yeah, the, the levels are getting harder and harder. That makes sense, right? more levels you go through, the harder it gets. Ooh, okay, onto the slime block. Oh, just about. Man, that's actually a pretty technical jump. The sliding off the honey, you gotta make sure you get the right speed and, uh, and, and the right height and stuff, and then you land on the slime block, making sure not to land on the edge, because the edge of slime block sucks. And you gotta bounce, you know, onto the block. It's kind of technical, kind of difficult. I'm surprised I got it first try. I, I've lost track of how many fails I've got so far, like six, seven, something like that. I, I don't really know. I do like that it's not a super difficult map though. I say that, it looks like it's going to get much harder now. Hmm, maybe I, maybe I spoke too early. It doesn't look too bad so far, but you know, I appreciate the trapdoor helping me out a little bit, making the jump a little easier. Give me that checkpoint, please. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, the checkpoints as well. They're pretty common. So, a fall-in is not much of an issue at all. I like it. Let's just, yeah, use momentum on that bit. Makes it a lot easier. And this as well. Okay. I was really worried about hitting the edge of that slime block, but we got it. Ooh. 200, is, I assume, seconds... It's weird because it's it's hard to set up like a, a second timer in Minecraft because it works in ticks and it, it's weird, I don't know. I appreciate the trapdoors. Makes it a lot easier to do strafe jumps and a lot of these jumps actually. I'm very surprised I made that one. That's unfortunate. This bit looks kind of difficult. It's just the ice, you know. If that was normal block, this bit right here would be pretty easy, but because it's ice, it's kind of... A bit tricky, there we go, stand on the edge to not get the slippery effect, makes it easier. That bit though, we do need the ice momentum I, I think. That was a big frame drop. I just realised, the world outside of this little map area has been deleted, so there's no random chunks being loaded and, you know, no slowing down of, of my game, even though I did get that one frame drop. I don't know why that happened, yeah, that was weird, but anyway. Let's focus on this and hope we can do it with the momentum. Momentum's all you need. 
really, really is. I'm going to even use it here as well. Into the fence, don't overshoot. All good. I could jump down to there. Is that backwards? I don't think it is. That's forwards, right? I've not been there yet, have I? Hmm. I don't want to... I don't want to jump backwards. I think I have... Yeah. I remember jumping on end. Uh, end walls. End stone walls. Are they a thing? I'm so, I, I, I don't remember those. End stone walls. I, I thought those were like stone walls and stuff. Interesting building block for a wall type. I don't know. Okay, a, a double strafe, but the, the honey made it a little easier. Not too bad. It's really quite difficult to see these blocks though. These fences, they're so thin and everything just in the foreground, in the background, in the middle ground is just orange. It's kind of bland orange. It's kind of hard to see the fences. But I guess that's part of the challenge, right? I don't know why I'm struggling so much on this, but there we go. And then this one. Okay, strafe again. The honey block definitely makes that a lot easier. Can I actually make this bit now? I really hope I can. I landed on the lantern then, but even if I stayed on it, I think I couldn't get on the fence anyway, so no point trying to. I nearly walked straight off that block. Okay. I was trying to keep the momentum because that jump after that one, after the one I failed in, is, is difficult. It's the one I keep failing on. Man, I'm struggling. 300 seconds. I assume the record is like 500 seconds or something crazy. But yeah, I don't know how long this section actually is. I don't even know what level I'm on. I've not been keeping track. I probably should have. Yeah, screw that jump. I don't like it. Checkpoint, thank you. I got a very itchy nose. Hey monk, how you doing? You got a nice little birch sapling there. Very nice. Nice earring. Probably not an earring, like a piercing. I don't know. It, it doesn't matter. Wow, that was close. Close to the edge of the slime block. Oh, okay. Please make this. Momentum. Speedy thing goes in, speedy thing comes out. And checkpoint. Uh, there's two ways to go here. Or not. That doesn't lead anywhere. I don't know what level this is, though. Is it one? Well, is it? That'll be level three, right? Three, four, five, six. I'm in six, seven, eight. Yeah, okay. I'm on level six right now. So not too far from the end. Pretty, pretty de decent. I, I don't really know why I have this helmet that resets me. That's difficult. I seem to just die as soon as I fall, and I'm not going to want to, you know, reset while I'm making progress. I don't know why I have it, but why not? Why not have it? Oh, man, I, it, it's definitely getting harder. Definitely. A bit tricky now. I need to concentrate more. I need to jump at the edge of blocks. To pick us one up. Got it. Ooh. Onto the edge. Onto the side of the block. Okay. That's kind of difficult. I think I need more momentum than that. Okay, let's try. Like that. It makes it easy. And then very, very thin glass panes. I could land on a lantern and jump up to the glass pane. I didn't need to though, so it's fine. Let's just not. I was worried that would hit my head on that, but I guess it's too high for me to do that. I appreciate that. Okay, this one may be difficult. My thick shoulders always getting in the way. Steve too swole. Ooh, that is quite difficult. A 45 degree strafe is, I think, known to be a difficult jump, but I feel like I'm getting kind of close. I feel like I can do it. Let's try it this way. First try. Now we need to make this one. Also first try. Okay, and then... Ooh, I see what I have to do. Man, I just barely made it onto the honey block. But we did it. And then... I'm... So worried right now. Please make it. Don't overshoot. Oh, that was very close. Please give me a checkpoint. Oh, it's right there. Oh, of course.
course it's a corner jump. <sighs> that was pressure. I would have lost so much progress all the way back to there and that, that was a lot of hard jumps. That 45 degree strafe, the three across one up, the honey jump and jump off the very edge of the honey block. I mean the, the green concrete but you know from where the honey is. Difficult jumps. I'm so glad I made that. These jumps are really getting quite hard now. I'm worried because this is only level 6. There's two more levels after this that are probably way harder. Because this is way harder than the one before it. So the difficulty is probably going to ramp up quickly. And the next two are going to be really, really difficult. Not looking forward to it. And the levels are getting longer and longer, so... Yeah, the difficulty just keeps getting more and more. I'm getting kind of worried. Okay, I'm glad this isn't just a, a normal 45 degree strafe. That's not a bad jump at all. Okay, now we don't have the iron trapdoors, but to be honest, they weren't needed in the first place. They made it a little easier, but I'm, I'm pretty used to strafe jumps. At least one block strafe jumps. Anything more than one block, it's kind of hit or miss. Two block strafe jumps... Yeah, it's like a... I'll probably miss it like, I don't know, 90% of times, but yeah. And then three three block strafe jumps, I'll probably miss it like 50 times. I don't know. Jump five blocks down. Uh, I don't want to jump. Do I just run off, I think? Or do I like jump around this? I'm going to try running off. Oh! Straight down. Like, directly down. That, yeah, that that's a lot easier than what I was trying to do. That sucks, because now I need to do all of this again. Oh, and it was kind of difficult. Okay. We can do this, though. We've done it once. We can do it again. Not too bad at all. Okay, this is also pretty easy to do. And then... Checkpoint. I should have got that earlier, but I, I didn't know that block existed. Slime under slime. Got it. Do that, and then... Oh, up there. That's an interesting way to, to jump. Knowing the map before you try to do it as fast as possible would definitely help with, you know, the time saves. Because so I think now I go to there, which I need to hold forward for, and I didn't hold forward. Oh, that was kind of close. I need to not hit the edge of this slime block, which I just did. That is quite tricky. There we go, we made it. Don't overshoot, and then onto there. Make sure I don't hit my head on anything, and we're good. We're at this section, which is actually near the middle, so hopefully this level ends soon and we can move on to level 7. A lot of sideways ladder jumps though, and they're quite difficult. Okay, we're now to that thing, I think to that thing, and then the last jump, and we made it. 798, 800 seconds, and level 7. Let's go 18 minutes into the video, and the second hardest part begins. I feel like this video is going to end up like 30 minutes long, because this part looks kind of difficult. That's probably a really long part. I'm surprised I made that. I'm so surprised I made that. Okay, the last part doesn't actually look too long, but it does look kind of difficult. So, this one right here might be the hardest one. That's a cool jump. Onto a, the thinnest cake slice. Okay, interesting jumps here. I'm going to scale the trapdoor tower. Surprisingly... Not too bad so far. These jumps look harder than they are. I'm very surprised. Okay, now this. What is this? I need to go round the corner on the, the honey block? You're kidding. I just jumped straight off. I just fell straight off. Round the corner. Oh, I probably just don't sprint at the end. At the edge, even. Make it. Wow, that is... Oh! I I made it. Please, please get a checkpoint soon. I don't want to do that again. 
I feel like I shouldn't have made that. Please get a checkpoint. Uh, where now? Do I could bounce to that and then bounce to that, but then... I don't know, or do I just bounce into that? I probably just bounce into that, right? It has to be. Surely. Oh. I can't touch the red? You're kidding. How do I... Was I supposed to jump? I don't know where to go there. That's... That's sucky. Not knowing where to go. Oh my... Okay, I made it first try. Okay, maybe it's not as hard as I thought it was. As long as you don't sprint on the honey block. It's pretty easy to go in the corner. But this bit, what do I do? Do I just... Oh, is it... Is it that simple? Like, down to here and then... Onto that? Is that right? And that's... This is like a red herring. That's not where you're supposed to go. It worked. I'll... I'll take it. I'll continue. Sure. Why not? Big jumps. It's really difficult when they're at an angle like this. There we go. Okay, okay. We're making it very slowly and with a lot of difficulty. I'm so worried right now. But we got a checkpoint. We did it. We got a checkpoint. It's all good now. We can fail as much times as we want. It's all good. We got a checkpoint. I apologize if you can hear any background noise. It's out of my control right now. Can I just jump from there? Yeah, that makes it easy. And then this one, also pretty simple. And then we go backwards. I like it. Do I go this way though? I do. Oh, I'm surprised. Itchy nose. Wasting seconds, I know. Until the slime, and there we go. Okay, bounce on that, and then we get a checkpoint. Please. I feel like... I don't know what it is. I, I just feel like I'm getting... Like, I'm making these jumps when I'm not supposed to. I feel like I shouldn't be making these jumps, but I'm just doing it. It's great. Why is that there? I I don't do that now, right? No, I, I jump from up there. I see, yeah, slime up down. Do I jump on that one? I think I do. I guess so. It worked. Sometimes it's hard to determine how much height you can get from a slime block. Uh, yeah, I, I do it again. Okay, stand on the edge so we can actually jump on honey blocks. And then, back we go. We are so close to the end of this level. This was way faster than I thought if I actually make this. Wait, what? How do I get up there? Or is that just... I don't... Okay, I just jump from here, right? Yeah, slime block to there, and then we're on the final level. Easy, easy jump. Okay. Double, triple, quadruple check that we have the checkpoint, and we are almost done. The last level. Probably going to be the very hardest. It looks like already it is. That's a pretty difficult jump. Man. Hopefully this doesn't take, like, ten minutes, because the video will be very long then. Oh, that is difficult. Maybe I should try going the other way, like this way. Mm, it's just as difficult. I mean, yeah, it's, it's the exact same jump, of course, but you know what I mean. I, I'm going too far out, I think. I need to get a better angle and not, I don't know, come in early, maybe? I don't know. It, I just can't move into it. Okay, yeah, the angle needs to be closer to the block. So I need to... It, I don't know why this is so difficult. This is harder than other one block strafe jumps. Man. It's because it's up by one. It's the up by one that really makes it difficult. I've done a much harder jump than this, though. And by much harder, I mean very slightly harder. It was this jump, but off of a honey block. Like, that block there would have been a honey block. And I think honey blocks are like a tiny, tiny, tiny bit shorter than a normal block, so it was actually, you know, very, very slightly harder for jump. And I managed to do it, but it took a lot of attempts. Kind of like that. Big jump. There we go. Okay, I don't know the hitboxes of glass panes. I'm gonna go wide. And it worked. There we go. Ooh, head parkour. Okay. That doesn't look fun. 
I want to use momentum, but I also don't want to jump back because that looks like a big jump. I wish I knew the hitboxes of glass panes, but oh, it's fine. We got a checkpoint. This looks tricky. Let's use momentum. Okay, that, that is very tricky. I think I hit my shoulder then. Okay. I think I'm jumping too early. Oh, that was too late. That was just... I missed the block entirely. Oh, wow, this is difficult. I just walked straight off. I'm struggling. Okay. I hit my shoulder. Oh, this is annoying. Please stop just walking off. How do you do this? Like, it's not the hardest jump in the world, but... Oh, I hate when that happens. When I get really into parkour, I just hold jump. I hold the jump button, I hold space, and I do that. And surprisingly, I just made it straight after. I don't know how I got it, how I got it like twice in a row. I was really hoping for three times in a row then. Okay, I'm, I'm getting it consistently, kind of. Saying that, I'm going to fail now, and I just jinxed it. So I'm never going to get it again. It, it took like two attempts to get it this time. I don't know why... I was struggling the first time so much, but I keep getting it in, in just a few attempts. Oh, what is that? I don't like this jump at all. This jump is this is actually easier because you get the extra ladder distance on it. So I'm going to go this way. Very, very slightly easier. But that was all the difference in the world. Do I want to jump from the head or from the block? Again, the ladder gives me an extra bit of distance. I think the block is easier. The extra little bit of height and the bit of distance from the ladder makes it quite easy. There we go. Oh, I hate these. But it's an easier version of those uh, because it was a, a long ladder instead of just a single ladder. Uh, okay, we're getting kind of close to the end. We're about three quarters of the way through, it looks like. Maybe, maybe two thirds. Not so bad so far. Ooh, okay, I mean the jumps definitely are kind of difficult, but Yep, I can make that But we are getting checkpoints. We're making progress. This is difficult as well Somehow made it first try. I don't know how I, I how I'm doing this a lot of these jumps are things that I've never really seen before it, It's just happening Okay Ooh. Can't believe I struggled so much on that on that jump down there that one and then I got it so many times in a row. Not in a row, but... Oh, okay. The glass pane tower, I struggle with this a lot. I'm going to be here for a while. I don't know if it's best to sprint or to just walk, but it's a weakness of mine. I always hit my shoulder. Like, the first one I do pretty often. The second one I can get every now and then. third one... It's like, yep, your shoulder just got twice as big. Now the jump is twice as hard. Luckily, there's only two jumps of those. If there was a third one, I would have been there for way, way longer. I seem to get worse the more of those jumps I do. So I'm glad it was over quickly. Do I jump to that? I think I do. That's a long jump. And then straight to the slime block, and then... Bounce. Oh, I'm so glad. I'm so glad I made it. What is this? It's a double strafe, but there's trap doors, so it's... Oh no, it's a... It's a triple strafe with trap doors. I love it. I, I love it so much. I hate it. Oh, I'm so bad at these. I have done this once before. I've done a triple strafe once before. The trap doors made that infinitely easier. I'm so thankful for those trap doors. Thank you, look up to the sky. Here I am, Lucy, and diamonds, here I am. There is diamonds. 1477, I probably could have saved like two seconds by standing on that quicker, but well done, press tab to see your death count. 101, that's a shame if you had one less. This map was made by Team Nawak, probably said that wrong. Uh, our deaths, Jar, 
341 and Saddle Run 814. I did it in way less deaths. I'm very surprised. TP back to lobby and TP in the temple. There's a secret entrance in the temple with a base. I want to see the, the time though. Is this uh, see your second part score doing the second? Okay, first part was 159. Second was 1477. See second part scores. What did I get? I got the, the record of the, the map builders. I did quite a bit better with way less deaths. I'm surprised. I'm happy about that. Very happy, and I guess I can't get up there, that's just decoration. But yeah, I guess that's it, that was uh, the, the only parkour to temple name. Name of temple. I, I I don't know how to say it, I've also forgotten the name. But anyway, that was it, so if you liked, be sure to like. If you really liked and want to see more like this, be sure to subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks so much for watching, and see ya.